All right, what is going on, guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, and today we are finally diving into the brand new Pokemon Sword that just came out for the Nintendo Switch. Um, actually, it came out a couple days ago, so I'm pretty late to the party on this one, but it's been such a crazy weekend, and I've been wanting to play it for basically the last two days, and I just didn't have any time, but you know what? We finally have uh, about 20 minutes to at least get started so we're gonna jump in guys i am super super stoked let's do this here we go so uh just for some backstory some history of my pokemon experiences uh i started playing pokemon pretty much back in like the 90s when um i think it started with like pokemon yellow or something like that okay so i'm gonna go with english obviously uh oh we're also choosing our avatar so um I'm probably going to go male here, but um, let's see. I think the first one actually probably matches me the most. So go with the first one. All right. So uh, as I was saying, oh, name too. Okay. One sec, guys. So <laughs> while I'm doing this, um, I started pretty much with like Pokemon Yellow, I think. Uh, but then I fell off pretty hard uh, somewhere around the end of like the DS era. So the last full Pokemon game I completed was pokemon platinum all right and uh, since then i played a little bit of sun a little bit of black and white but uh, not nearly as much as i should have i never finished them so it's gonna be the first pokemon game i complete all the way through in a long time all right so i'm gonna shut up now let's watch this intro animation here we go Welcome on all to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. I wish there was voice acting. I really do. I mean, I think we're still too early for that, but one of these days, I hope that one of these Pokemon games has actual, like, legit voice acting. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. That's a new one. Thanks to the help of these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. So, um, <laughs> there's gonna be a lot of Pokemon I don't I don't recognize, even the ones from like the previous generation, because like I said, I haven't been keeping up too much. So I don't know if this is like a brand new Pokemon. It probably is, but I have no idea what its name is. Uh, that's gonna happen a lot here. All right. Okay. Yes, Pokemon are all around us in the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. Okay. And who are you? And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon Trainers. Sweet. All right, lots of random people. Oh, and I'm getting, but I'm getting, getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose, and it is a pleasure to be here. Now, turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's Exhibition Match. Alright, so the new champion is called Leon. Got it. Got it. So that's who, who you gotta beat at the end of this game. Cool. Um, <laughs> that's quite the... It's quite the, the beard he's got going on there. It's like, it's like two Nike swooshes. Two Nike swooshes. Two backward swooshes. That's cool. Exhibition or not, Leon, your pristine record. Pristine record is about to end today. Uh, you know I don't lose battles, Ray, Ray, Ray Han. Oh, Dynamax. Okay, I haven't seen this one yet. That is freaking sick. That's fire. Pun intended. Damn, dude. <laughs> so they're starting us right off with a Dynamax Charizard. Okay, cool. They, yo, they know how to get us excited. That's for sure, man. Damn, yo, I can't wait to see all these like Dynamaxes. I've seen a few just like random ones here and there. I've tried to stay away from, um, you know, like trailers and stuff like that as much as possible because I would like to go into games completely blind. So there's a lot of stuff about this game I still don't know. Uh, we're going to learn about it as we go, obviously. That's the, kind of the way I prefer it. So uh, yeah, it's going to be fun. I heard there's a Dynamax a Champ. There's a Dynamax Gengar. Uh, yeah, I'm excited. Okay. Uh, hop. Hello, hello! So that's us on the couch right there. Oh, that your flash new phone, tiger? The what? 
Oh, that your flash new phone, Tiger. What does that mean? Your flash new phone. Is that right? Is that like a like a typo or something like that? What does that mean? Your flash new phone. I'm spending too much time on this. I don't know what that means though. Okay, cool. Uh, <laughs> are you watching Lee's exhibition match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Okay, so that's our friend Hop. I'm guessing he's gonna be like the the rival for this for this game. Okay, Hop, didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Well, that's our mom. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's exactly why I came running over to get Tiger. Never mind watching the match now. I've got a recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. Oh. So he's the champion's little brother. Come with me, Tiger. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Now I've got to run. See you. See you at mine later. Okay. But let's get our asses off this couch right here. Put our flash new phone away. Whatever that means. Oh, Munchlax. Let's talk to this Munchlax. He says nothing. Cool. I love. I love Munchlax, man. Um, let's, let's walk around a little bit. Let's explore a little bit. It's a television that Mum uh, uses to watch her comedy dramas. Okay, uh, let's check out this fireplace. It's a fireplace that's built into the house. It keeps things warm in the harshest winter. Speaking of harsh winters, man, it sucks in Canada right now. Just a random side note. <laughs> there are lots of books and magazines about Pokemon neatly lined up. Um, there are lots of books and magazines about Pokemon neatly lined up. Okay. So let's, uh, let's head out, I guess. If you're looking for your bag, Tiger. Didn't you leave it in your room? And grab yourself a hat for the winter, for the weather as well. Okay, um, there's the kitchen, so I'm guessing this is our room. Yo, they actually put a switch here. <laughs> Look at that, right beside the, vocal, the Pikachu sl uh, slushy. Um, no, stuff. did I say slushy? Oh, the Pikachu stuffy? Pikachu plushy, 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 uh, is a freaking Nintendo Switch, guys, that's hilarious. Let's see what it says. The latest video game console is sitting by the telly. The telly? Okay. The brand new telly. Your mom bought it so that you could use your game console. Alright. Uh, let's grab our bag. Here we go. You grabbed your dad's old bag. So that is some bag. Man, that is like half the size of our body. This man is just supposed to like lug that around for the next 100 plus hours. Alright man, uh, adventure guide. Press the X menu by pressing the X button. You can save your progress by selecting save from the X menu. You can also check your location, your next location by selecting, or your next destination by selecting the town map. You can check it, this adventure guide anytime you want in the key item section of your bag. Cool. Uh, let's head out guys and see what great adventures have, or they have in store for us. So I think I'm gonna go up until like, we choose our starter. Um, and then maybe our first battle. And um, that's probably gonna be it for today's video. Uh, I might do more videos in the future, or maybe I'll just like do the rest of the gameplay through streams. So if you guys are interested in checking that out, you know, staying up to date with that stuff, then definitely, uh, first of all, like the damn video if you're enjoying it, but also subscribe to the channel and stay up to date with all my Pokemon content that's coming up, guys. There should be a good amount of it. There should be a good amount of it, okay. Ha ha ha, have a look at you, Tiger. Your old bag, that little old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's as big as a Snorlax. Okay, is that, are the sheep Pokemon? Or are they just like, miscellaneous sheep? A Wooloo, but what's it doing here? Okay, so, I'm guessing Pokemon, Wooloo, all right. Um, next generation Mareep, I suppose. Hey, you silly Wooloo, I see what you're up to. Don't go ta using tackle on the fence. Now you listen, no going past that fence, no. Everyone knows that there are scary Pokemon living in the slum wheeled field. What? <laughs> Me? Now that's taken care of. Uh, how about it, Tiger? Let's race, but I can make it to my house first. Uh, what with you lugging around, lugging about that big old bag. Y'all can't read today, man. 
I think I, I think it's because I'm too excited. I'm just excited to like go, go, go. But I'm like, I should read it too, just for you guys. But man, it's been such a long time since I've played a Pokemon game, and this one looks really freaking good. Yo, um, no joke, these graphics, pretty solid, guys. Pretty solid. It's very, very like vibrant, very um, bright. It, obviously, it's not like next gen graphics. It's not comparable to like PS4 graphics or anything like that, but um, I gotta say, I really like it. I really like it. Okay, let's see what this guy has to say. The power of science is amazing. Now you can battle and trade Pokemon with other people just by walking around. Isn't that super amazing? Wow, super amazing. All right, um, do we go this? Hey, Tiger, Hop was looking for you, you know. Oh, but no need to go to the next town to find when he lives right next door, right? Okay, so it's over here. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, let's go in here. I'm guessing this is the way to go. Okay, we made it. We made it. So far, so good. So far, so good. I almost got lost in the first five minutes, but it's all good. Uh, Mom, is he here? And there you are at last, Hop. Oh, and you brought Tiger along. Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in a cupboard? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, Hop, you must learn some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. And that's where I'm going. You know Lee is hopeless with directions. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. <laughs> oh, you will? Yes, that's probably for the best. You've got to come with, Tiger. You've still never met my big bro, right? You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you out on the route. Cool. Is it route or route? Hey, what do you guys say? <laughs> Let me know in the comments. Is it route or route? I think I say it both ways, depending on my mood. Like, I just said route there, but sometimes I say route. Um, I don't know. I'm terrible at pronouncing things. Let's get it. Move on. Only remember, Tiger, wild Pokemon could come out of uh, nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. But I've got my I've got my Wooloo with me, so I'm ready for battles against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, Tiger. So we'll steer clear of the tall grass as we go. Okay. Sounds reasonable. Can we run yet? Like, do I do I press B or? Uh, no, that's 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 a menu. Uh. I don't think we can run yet. That's fine. Guess we'll get our um, running shoes in a bit. Wedge Hurst. And there is the champion with his Charizard. Man, that... <laughs> like, he, look, he looks pretty cool. I, I, I like the cape. I like the purple hair. Um, I dig, you know, his facial features, all that stuff, but the... <laughs> The beard, man. Like, what is that? <laughs> like, the gap in the middle? I don't know, man. I, I, I don't know if it does it for me. I, I, I don't know if I feel, I'm feeling that. Hello, hello, Wedgehurst. Your champion, Leon, is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. It's our unbeatable champion, Leon. You and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. Uh, I hope you'll all carry on your training, uh, carrying on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it. We're, we've all been working on our battle skills just like you've uh, taught us to, Lee. Yeah, is it me or is it lagging a little bit? It's like, there's like a little bit of like stuttering here and there. Like, you, like Especially with the little kid. You see the little kid? The blonde little kid at, at, at the bottom left? He's like, he's like a little bit laggy. It's kind of weird. Anyways, it doesn't bother me. I don't really care too much. Just uh, something that probably needs to be fixed in a patch or something like that. Uh, but that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. Too true, that Charizard is blazingly strong, but other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challengers to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. My wish is for Galar's trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Rawr, says Charizard. <laughs> Yo, that's sick. I want a Charizard. Yo, can I choose? Can I choose a Charmander as opposed to any of the new starters? Because I'm not, I'm not really feeling them too much. Not gonna lie. I mean, the bunny's okay. 
the water thing is like like the tadpole thing is like kind of cool until it's final evolution and then it looks really weird and the monkey is okay too he's like i think medium like he's probably like my second pick i'm most likely gonna go with the bunny but yo if i could choose the charmander charmander all day man og starters all day pop i'm sure you guys feel the same way i'm sure most of you that play like have played pokemon like from the beginning i mean it's, it's always gonna be gen 1 pokemon over everything right uh, so, my number one fan in the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Very specific. Bingo! That's the sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, eh, Lee? And these bright eyes over here. I've got it. You must be Tiger, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar Champion's greatest ever Pokemon Champion and a massive Charizard fan, too. Yo, who isn't a Charizard fan? Let's be real. Who is not a Charizard fan? If you like Pokemon, you're a Charizard fan. People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee, and you, Tiger. Bet I can beat the both of you back home. That Hop always wanted to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special. I wonder who that rival could be, guys. I wonder. Well, everyone, I bid you farewell for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have a champion time. Can have a champion time? Okay, okay. <laughs> Yo, some of this, some of these phrases are a little bit weird to me, man. I don't know if it's just me um, not getting it or if it's actually worded kind of weird. Let me know. Let me know. Is, is it me? Is it me or are some of these... Like, sentence is actually kind of structured oddly. I don't know. Come on, Lee. You promised me... You promised us a present, so out with it. You brought Tiger and me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then. The greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. Oh, starter time. Starter time. Here we go. Uh, like I said, I think the water guy is really weird. So I'm probably not going to go with him. Take a good look, you two. Alright, grass type Grookey. Got the fire type Score Bunny and the water type Sobel. Oh, there's a little animation for them too. That's sick. I like that. Alright, so Score Bunny's running around, little fire fireballs in its path, and uh, Sobel spits out some water. And uh, Grookey bangs a pear. Sweet. <laughs> I mean, they're cute. They're cute. Like, I'm not. I'll give you that. They are. They are cute. I like all three of them. But I feel like Score Bunny is the way to go because the final evolution looks the least weird. I wouldn't say the best, but the least weird to me. Which will you choose? Yeah, I think I'm set on Scorp. I don't know. Kind of like Grookey too. Grookey or Score Bunny. Hmm. I don't know, guys. Man, I wish I was live right now. Honestly, I could just ask people uh, to tell me what they picked and like maybe do a vote or something. But since it's a video, I don't really have that choice, right? I don't really have that option. Um, definitely not a uh, Soulbowl. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, I like how they turn to you too. Like they like, ah oh, man, I, I like Grookey. I like Grookey a lot actually. <sighs> Is Grookey? I mean, out of the three, like are any of them like, which which one's the best? I I didn't even know. I haven't really been keeping tabs on that stuff. Oh, it's a tough choice. It's a tough choice. Uh, man, I'm always scared I'm gonna regret like making one choice and having having to reset. But I I think I I think I'm gonna go with. Score no Grookey. Um, Score Bunny Grookey. Ah oh, man, I could sit here for like an hour, literally just like going back and forth, back and forth. Any, mini, mini. Ah man, I wish I was live right now. You could just tell me what to do. Okay, uh, monkey or bunny? I mean, monkeys are pretty cool. And uh, he becomes like this like rock star gorilla thing later on. 
uh, with like the, the crazy hair and everything. Uh, this one just becomes kind of like um, a bigger bunny, like not as unique, I think. I think the one with the most unique design is probably Grookey's final evolution. All right, fine, let's go with Grookey. We're going with Grookey, let's go. And he's cute, man. He, I think he's the cutest out of three. I, I think he is. Uh, the grass type Pokemon, Grookey, eh? It's soothing like a nice long walk in the woods. If you say so, okay. Uh, grass type Pokemon, Grookey, is it? Is it? It is. We're going with Grookey. Let's get it. You know what? The whole time I was talking, like I was gonna, I was gonna choose uh, Score Bunny, but no. You know what? We went with Grookey, and I'm on, I'm not gonna regret my decision. I'm not gonna regret my decision. Uh, what should we call this Grookey? I do usually like to nickname my starter Pokemon. Uh, what is my favorite monkey? Um, I can name him George. Curious George. <laughs> Um, what other cool monkeys are out there? Uh, oh! Yo, I got it, I got it, I got it. Marcel. Marcel the monkey. Um, if you guys watch Friends, you guys know exactly what that reference is. If you don't, then what are you doing with your life? Man, go watch Friends. Watch Friends right now. Yo, stop watching this video. Go watch Friends. And once you finish all seven seasons, or no, pff, my bad, all ten seasons, and rewatch them like five times like I did, then come back to this video and finish it out, all right? Uh, is that how you spell Marcel? Okay, so it looks like it's just M-A-R-C-E-L. So we got it right, all right? So our group key is gonna be named Marcel. Friends referenced once again, guys. Marcel has been added to the party. All right, you know what? I committed. We're not going back. We're not going back. We got a high five from our monkey. Totally worth it. Perfect. I'm not regretting it. I'm not regretting it. So it'll be Grookey for you, nice one. Then I'll go with Soulbowl, you're mine. All right, this was the right choice. <laughs> this was the right choice. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I'll be doing some serious training. Ah, uh, poor score, poor score bunny. Poor score bunny. I feel bad for the, I always feel bad for the remaining Pokemon that doesn't get picked. I'll bet you will be, Hop. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and Tiger. So the two of you can battle and train and grow stronger together to try to reach me. Aww, I feel so bad now. Or buddy. And you'll come with me. Oh, yo, she gets to go with the champ. You know what, you know what? I don't feel so bad anymore. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind too. Yeah, I mean, if he's gonna be with the champ, I think he's gonna be fine. He's gonna be totally fine. All right, enough of uh, all this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's all eat. Sweet. Oh, some kebabs on the grill. I like it. Some, uh, some good times. <laughs> I like, I like this new, uh, this new friend, man. Uh, what's his name? Hop. Seems fun. Seems like a fun guy. The next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? The two, uh, you two getting along all right? Understanding one another? Maybe even built up a bit of love? Of course I have, Lee. Tiger's made fast friends with this Grookey, too. And listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday, you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What are you looking for? What are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who'll be ch uh, coming to challenge you. If you think Tiger might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But who else are you gonna choose? It's literally just me. Like, I'm the only option. <laughs> but I'm, I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat, to beat the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know? Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be first rate in battle, too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. Uh, what do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop on in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Yes. Well, it's not the first Pokemon battle of my life, but it's the first one in many years. Many years. Uh, believe in your partner po Pokemon and care for them too with all your heart. Do those two things and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, to have a champion time battling with them. 
Looks like everyone's on board, Pokemon and trainers alike, then let's do this. I've watched every match that Leaves ever had. I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. If you say so. Man, this, this game is so just beautiful, man. Like, I, I love the graphics. I really do. I love the colors. It's so vibrant. It's so clean. Uh, you're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. I'm gonna have a lot of fun here. This man has two Pokemon. He has a Wooloo and a Sobol. Doesn't seem fair. Doesn't seem fair. Pokemon battle, it is then. I've got two partners with me. Alright, Marcel, let's go. Let's go. Um, we're gonna go with a Scratch. We're gonna go with a Scratch. I could Growl, but I just feel like it's not necessary here. Especially because he's only level 3. Opposing Wulu use Tackle. Okay, there's no... We, we can't die here, right? There's no way we can actually lose this fight. I don't think. I don't think, at least. It'd be very embarrassing if I lost this fight. <laughs> Um, let's go with another scratch here. And that should be KO for Wulu. And we should be leveling up here as well. Beautiful. Stats went up. Marcel learned Branch Poke. Okay, Branch Poke. It's not over yet. I've added another trusty ally to my team. Pokemon Trainer Hop sends out Soul Blue. Alright, alright, here we go. Uh, let's use our branch poke, type advantage. Let's go all the way. Oh, the actual branch pops out? That's pretty dope. Did you already know about type advantages? Oh my god. Oh my god. How did I know that uh, grass type is strong against water type? That's crazy. I'm Pokemon genius, guys. Uh, surprise. You know what? I was, I was hiding it this whole time. I'm actually a genius when it comes to. Pokemon battles. Um, I don't want to brag about anything, but you know what? It's, it's kind of hard to hide now, right? <laughs> Alright, that's that. Marcel grew to level 7. You defeated Pokemon Trainer Hop. You beat my two Pokemon with your one, and you and that Grookey are too much. You got 400. Uh, what would it be like? Poke Dollars, I think? For winning. I think it's called Poke Dollars, right? I almost said Zenny because that's in Dragon Ball, but I don't think it's Zenny. Well, that was a shock. I guess I know now why Lee thought he would uh, he should give you a Pokemon too. You and Pokemon all fought, fought hard. It made me almost want to let Charizard out <laughs> and join in all the fun. Can you imagine this man sends out his Charizard against my level 5 Grookey? Uh, good effort out there, Grookey. Why don't I get you all sorted? And Tiger, you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make the both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me battle now, Lee, so come on, you've got to let me take on the Pokemon James. You? Join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there. <laughs> Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there, little brother. Pokemon puns, okay. I guess not really a pun. Anyways, uh, if that's really what you want to do, you two have a whole lot to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Tiger. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. A uh, trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. It's more than just a collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it. Pokédex is then. We're on it. Uh, looks like it's off to the Pokémon Research Lab for you and me, Tiger. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokédex will be nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You'd probably better go to your mom that we're heading out, though. Uh, sweet. I guess we'll just end it off here. You know what? Let's go talk to our mom real quick. Rash. Tiger, did you hear that just now? Oh, it's the it's the Wulu. It broke through the, the gate. The gate's open and the Wulu that was there. He's gone. Oh my god. What are we gonna do? It was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through, do you? I mean, the gate's open, so I'ma say probably. Probably. But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. 
I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterward. Tiger, what do you say? Uh, we've got to save it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't know if I really care about this Wulu. Like, uh, why don't we just let it do its thing? Okay, fine. Let's save it. Let's save it. <laughs> right? Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in, Tiger. All right, let's go in. Let's go in. All right, one sec, guys. I'm getting a call here. Give me a second. I'll be right back. And we're back. Let's uh, go save this. Wulu here. Uh, slumbering wield. What is that? What? What's a wield? What's a wield? I feel like, yo, I feel like I'm so old now that there's some new words that were created that I just don't know anymore. Like, is that the case? That Wulu, where do you think it got off to? The fog is really coming on thick now. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Okay. Let's find this Pokemon. Uh, what's this? Uh, what is that? <laughs> A wild what? Squ squirrel? Squirrel it? Oh, squ scroll, scroll bet. Okay. Squirrel bet. Got it, got it. It'll take me a long time to learn these names, guys. A long ass time. I mean, especially because there's a whole new gener generation of Pokemon, but there's also like older generations of Pokemon that I still don't know either, right? Like, I think I'm most familiar, obviously, with Generation 1, uh, some Gen 2, mostly Gen 2, actually. Uh, and then beyond that, it gets a little bit fuzzy. It does get a little bit fuzzy. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be. <laughs> it's gonna be a rough time for a while. I should I try to catch it? But do I have any balls? I don't think I have any balls. So I probably couldn't have... <laughs> Yo, nobody clip that, alright? Nope, nobody clip that. <laughs> There's a clip of me saying, I don't think I have any balls. I don't have any Pokeballs. No Pokeballs. In my inventory, that's what I meant. You know what I meant, come on. Alright, let's use a uh, branch poke on the... Rookity. Rookity. Is that another new one? I hope so. Uh, not very effective. Got it. Use Leer. Um, I guess we'll go back to the Scratch then. Marcel used the Scratch. And he's dead. Dope, dope. Yo, guys, let me know in the comments down below if you guys are playing right now. Number one, let me know if you went with, uh, Sword or Shield. Alright, Sword or Shield, and also why. Why did you choose one over the other? Did you hear that? Was that a Pokemon crying? Was that a Pokemon crying out? You think? Uh oh, another another wild Pokemon, another squo 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 bet. <laughs> All right. Um, so I chose Sword, obviously, as you guys saw, but or you know, you're watching it right now. And the reason I went with Sword was for one reason and one reason alone and it was Surfetched guys Surfetched I freaking love Farfetched all right I've been wanting him to get a evolution forever since forever and uh, as much as I love that you know Alolan uh, it's Ponyta right I think it's Alolan Ponyta uh, as much as I am gonna miss the lack of Tyranitar on this side um, oh, I couldn't forego, I couldn't forego him, man. I couldn't forego Surfetched. I just, I had to have Surfetched. And I can get the other stuff too, just by trading with friends, right? So it doesn't really matter too much. Come on, Tiger, that Wulu might be in real trouble. Also, my second question. Second question was, uh, which starter do you guys choose? Alright, I went with Grookey, because, I don't know, it's just a feeling, you know, you, you guys, it took me a second to decide, but... Uh, I feel like ultimately it was the right decision. But who did you guys choose? This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I think I get now why this place is off limits. What's gonna happen? What's going on? Something's coming. I can feel it. Oh, it's a. Uh, uh, what was his name? Zacian? Is it Zacian? Is that how you pronounce it? I could be wrong about that. 
What in the? Oh, yeah, another reason I chose Sword, because I felt like the Legendary was cooler. Or looked less dumb than the other one. I'm not saying the other one really looked that dumb, it's just like, I think this one looked better. With the Sword. You know, I, I feel like Dog with Sword looks better than Dog with Shield Beard. <laughs> you know? Alright, uh, I'm guessing we're not going to do too well here. We're probably going to die right about... Right about now. The mysterious Pokemon's gaze is fixed on you. What? The move had no effect on it? Um, Let's go with the branch poke. Why not? Maybe this will be more effective. Oh, look at that. Same, same deal. Surprise, surprise. Um... So it doesn't look like he's attacking us. Tiger, I can't see anything. You okay? Um, scratch again, I guess. Marcel, you scratch. The move had no effect. Okay, so this is gonna go on for a little while, I think. Or maybe we're done now. Damn. It's uh, really, it's really getting foggy around here. I, I actually can't see anything anymore. What? <laughs> My voice acting skills are still not uh quite on par. All right, all right. Don't don't come to this channel for voice acting. All right, voice acting quality not gonna be great, but um, yeah. That's it. otherwise, you know, we're gonna have a lot of fun. Just don't expect top notch voice acting here. Hop tiger. What, Lee? How'd you manage to find your way here? Your pants with directions. You always get- wait, what? Your pants with directions. What does that mean? What does pants with directions mean? Is that a new phrase that the kids are saying now? <laughs> that I just don't know about because I'm old? <laughs> what does that mean? Your pants with directions? Okay, Hop. All right. I'll... You do you. All right. Your pants. Uh, oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you, and uh, you never showed. Of course, I came here looking for the both of you. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue that Wooloo. Yo, that Charizard's about to eat the, the Wooloo, man. <laughs> I know it's supposed to be like, you know, he saved it or whatever, but it looks like this Charizard's about to just chomp down on this sheep right there. Uh, though all of you had fainted by the time I found you here, you know this place is out of bounds, but it took courage to come in here all the same, and I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. And at least that Wooloo's alright, yeah, Tiger? I thought we'd had it when that big fog started rolling in and that Pokemon, uh, mad Pokemon started attacking, but at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? What you talking about, Hop? It seems loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really? They seem to pass right through it. The moves pass right through it. The fearsome Pokemon, they say, live in the slobbering wield. Are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. But now let's simply get out of uh, this place. You'll uh, be all right now that I'm here with you. Uh, even if we did get a year full from Lee, what an experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. Okay. Don't forget to say, Mum, we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. She'll go spare. Yeah, another, like, very strange expression that I've never heard anybody use before. She'll go spare. Like, I know that means she'll be mad, she'll be angry, but she'll be, she'll go spare? Alright, um, guys, I think we're gonna call it here. Oh, we got some, a uh, couple of badoos on our, on our lawn, cool. Uh, I'm gonna save, of course, so let's uh, save our game here, make sure we don't lose our progress. And that's gonna do it for today's video, guys, the beginning of a brand new adventure in Pokemon. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, I'm most likely not going to make more gameplay videos or maybe like for special things like Elite Four or like catching the legendary Pokemon or something like that. But otherwise, uh, I'm going to be playing in my own time, but also doing some streams on YouTube and Twitch along the way. So if you guys want to stay tuned for those streams, for those gameplay 
um, videos and stuff like that, then definitely subscribe to the channel, smash that subscribe button, join the Tiger Squad now. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, like the damn video, hope you guys enjoyed today's video, hope you guys are having fun with the game as well if you did get it. And um, join me on my Pokemon adventure guys, the first one in... I want to say more than five years. It's been a really long time since so I played a full, like, real Pokemon game. Not including, like, the mobile ones I played, like, Pokemon Masters, Pokemon Go, so on and so forth. Those are not legit Pokemon games, even though some of them were pretty decent. And uh, I can't wait to play some more, but today I gotta run, gotta be somewhere, so we gotta cut it short. Um, and that's it, guys. Like I said, like the damn video, subscribe to the channel if you want to stay up to date with all that Pokemon content. And until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.